Hello everybody, welcome to this Tech Hut video. Uh, right now I'm going to show you a plugin called Tree Assist. And with this plugin, all it does is when you cut down a tree on the where the last log is, it'll automatically set a sapling. It's really good so there's not uh, clear cuts of trees or random floating shrubs anywhere. It's very, very helpful. Um, so I'm going to show you how to get it real quick. Um, you're going to want to go to their form. I'll have a direct download link on either the TechCut forms or TechCut.us. So I'm going to click download jar. It's going to take me to Media Fire. I'm pretty sure if it wants to load. There we go. So I'm going to click here to start download. It's going to download the tree assist dot jar. It's already done. So now I'm going to open up my server folder, go into plugins, and I already have it in here. But basically, mine's right here. All you're going to want to do is drag your tree assists into your uh, plugins folder. So that's basically all you do with that. Now you're going to want to restart your server by stopping it and then opening it again and there shouldn't be any errors. If there is, try it again. Uh, if you get another error that's related to the Tree Assist plugin, just uh, leave a comment and I'll try to help you. So now we're going to go see if it works. So I'm going to get into my server and make it a little lighter so you can see. I apologize for the uh, black square in the middle beforehand. So let's see here. That's yeah, that's that. Um, <laughs> I'll get my diamond axe out so I can show you this. This is a good tree to test it on right here. So let's get out this axe. Let's start out by oh, I need to. CV off. Alright. So let's break this. And then that's the last one. When I break it, a sapling grows back, which is very, very convenient. If you're in my server, please cut down the entire tree, by the way. So let's test that out again. So, the last one. I'm going to cut it. And a sapling grows goes there which is very very nice so now I'm gonna cut down these trees well most of it anyway for now I'll finish cutting this one down in a sec and I'm not gonna have to worry about replanting them because they automatically grow back which is very very convenient to have in your server because sometimes just people be lazy and they cut down trees without at least attempting to regrow some of them back so that's that plugin. This was my very first video on bucket plugins. I hope you liked it. Please subscribe. I'm going to be doing uh, a video on the quests plugin next, which is this um, Q and then give. And I already have an active quest, so Q info info. Yeah. So that's going to be my next video is that plugin. Once again, hope this one helped you. Please go to my forums, sign up, get some information on how to join the server here. Uh, I hope you have a good day and goodbye.